Hey guys, and welcome to another part for Resident Evil 2. Sorry, I, I was in slow motion mode because I had to make sure that my mic was actually hey guys, working. To oh my gosh. Shh. Phone? Okay. Um, so, last time we played, we finished Leon's side of the story. Um, this time we're going to be starting Claire's side of the story. So this is kind of like the second playthrough. I don't know, something like that. But we are gonna get started here. Did I break everything? Oh my gosh, I think everything is broken. Stinking Facebook has broken everything. Well, we're gonna have to restart because Facebook has broken everything. So that's wonderful. Hang on, let's see if I can fix it. Hang on. Hang on. So I don't typically stream on Facebook, but I thought it would be fun to try that today. There we go. I've got one part. Hang on. Let me see if I can get the cam going. Hang on. Come on. Come on. Come back to me, camera. Ah, uh, there we go. All right. We're ready now. Hopefully, do we have sound? I didn't see it, but we'll, we'll see it in a second. You'll know before I do. Yeah, there we go. In the midst of the tea. All right, so yeah, this is kind of like playthrough number two, Leon Kennedy and we're going through um, Claire's story. His encounter with one of the only other survivors, a woman named Ada, a spy seeking the deadly G virus. However, Ada. Leon was not the sole survivor of the incident. A girl named Claire Redfield was in town on business of her own. She came to uncover the mysterious circumstances of her brother's disappearance. Chris Redfield, a member of the Star's Alpha Team. Only now her mission has become quite simple. Survive. Basic survival within the <laughs> nightmare that was once Raccoon City. I like how it sounds like a, um... It sounds like a documentary. Basic survival. Now they're gonna have interviews of Claire's parents. She was always a good kid growing up. Never really into those zombies. Boy, my lighting is low today. Hopefully that helps a little bit. Here. So like I said before, we are streaming on Facebook and Twitch, so if you're watching this on Facebook, welcome, welcome. I should be able to see both chat rooms, I'm not sure, but hopefully. Guy's a maniac. Why'd he bite me? Hello? Is anyone here? Hello? Hello? Uh, hello? Uh, excuse me. I'm in the middle of dinner right now. Look, I'm sorry I bothered you, okay? Just don't come any closer. Are you listening? Can 
can't stay out here. Head to the police station. It'll be a lot safer. There! Buckle up. Okay. This is a huge license plate, by the way. What's going on? The zombies are like, hey! And the whole place went Great. insane. The radio's out. You're a cop, right? He's driving like yeah. this. First day on the job. Great. Oh. Nice to meet you. Mine's Claire. Claire Redfield. I came to find my brother, Chris. Hey, could you open the glove box? Sure. There's Still fully inside. impressed that this Better zombie can me. drive a truck. No! <laughs> you okay? Still in one piece. He's like, I've got an order to fulfill. Claire! Leon! I'm okay. Head to the station. I'll meet you there. Okay. All right. All right, let's see if I remember tank controls. It's been a few days since we played. I think I played maybe last Wednesday? No, last Tuesday, something like that. All right, looks like I can just go forward. I should have a gun on me, though I don't really need it. No, no, no. I don't know if we want to go this way. It's locked. It's locked. <laughs> No, oh, that's too bad. Can I get by him? Yeah. Oh, whoa, whoa, whoa. Claire, watch it. Alright, we need past them. We'll bait them in like this. We'll run around. Yay, it worked! Alright, what do we got in here? Ah, the key. Anything else useful? Probably not. Anything ah! useful over here? Nope, just zombies. sitting here waiting for the door to open and I have to hit the button. Alright, what do we got? I think there's a save point here. Yeah, and some ammo. I think we'll go ahead and use the save point. Everything that's in here pretty sure we did I guess I can check this notepad though I don't think it's 
think. Uh oh. I thought for sure they like opened something. Nothing special. That's a pain in the butt. Or she's just gonna walk out of the way for me. That's fine. I'm okay with that. Hey, get over here! Hurry! I can't oh, no. The mall I'll cop is not gonna survive. So I'm pretty sure we're not going to be able to turn this on. All right, we've already got health, which is way better than in uh, Leon's. Part. We didn't get health until like way later. I feel like we may have missed something. No? I guess not. Oh, ravens. Great. No, no, no. No, 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 no! Ah, crap, leave me alone! No! Hmm, nope. Nope, 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 nope. Ah, crap, no. Oh no, there's nothing this way! official safe room I think I read this already oh yeah I've read all that already. I remember that from the first first time I was in here. Man, they are being very generous with the ammo again. I remember they were like this. I need to just avoid more. All right, we're never gonna use that. Um, I think we're okay on health for a little while. If not, I can always come back in here. Um, do I want to save it again? Maybe not.
Oh, we're on the second floor. Pretty sure. Yeah. This, I don't think I can drop this down. Oh, yeah, I sure can. Good. Are the puzzles going to be the same? Oh, so shotgun just chilling over here. I'll go ahead and take that. Oh, grenade launcher. Never mind. <laughs> okay, we've got some more ink ribbons. I'll drop those off. All right, I need the key card. Last time I got it from this guy over here. And we, oh no, it wasn't that one. Was it this one? No. Maybe because we're starting down here, we can't open any of these. Let's, uh, let's go back up the ladder. It must be what we need. Keep going up here. Hang on, I wanna make sure that comments are working for me. I can see why can I see it over here that's lame ah here I was in the wrong spot that's why yeah now I can see him all right I can see him now Sorry to anyone who's been in chat over on Facebook. I'm a moron. Welcome. Welcome in. <laughs> Alright, hopefully. Uh, I think I'm gonna have to kill this guy. I didn't kill him. There he's dead. worry about them again can't get in there uh oh wait 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 okay oh my gosh there's three hmm I don't even know if there's another door over there So I can get in over here. I don't think this goes anywhere though. Is there another? Let's check the map. Oh, not files. No, 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 no. Okay. Yeah, there's nothing else there. I can't go in that room. Man, game, what do you want from me? I must have missed something somewhere. We'll try and go back down below and check that out. Oh, there is another room. Ah, uh, the raven room. Yeah. I'll have to check that out. <clears throat> hmm. 
No, no, no. Okay, we just need in the store. I also need to try using the lockpick periodically. See if that helps me any. Pretty sure this will get us down below. Yeah. We can have more health than we know what to do with. Not a bad problem to have. Might do a combined on one of them very soon. All right, it's this room. I mean, we have these if we need them. I would really not, I would really not use them if I don't have to. Let's see what kind of damage we got in here. You take the crank or this. <laughs> That'll get us in that one door. Can we get out? Yes, we can. I think there's like a ton of zombies out here too. Oh yeah. Nope, 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 nope. No, thank you. Oh. Okay. I mean, there's stuff in here that I want, but I don't know if I want to deal with all the jerks that are in here. <clears throat> I have enough stuff in here. I have the crank now. <clears throat> I should be able to turn that water on. Let's try and do that. It's funny because now I know the puzzles, it's just, you gotta go from them, um, you gotta get to them from a different angle, which is fun. All right, we gotta go back by the birds again. Gosh dang birds. No, 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 leave me alone. Oh, lucky, lucky. All right. Turn the water on. I think there's really oh yeah there was something to collect acid rounds okay so we should be able to get into uh oh thing great <laughs> I 
All right, no more going out there. I think this is the big guy. I mean, I'm gonna equip this. I have no idea what I'm doing. Just run. Running is what I'm doing. All right. Hopefully, we don't have to deal with that guy again. Ever. All right. The liquors are in this room, or at least they were. Are they not now? thing that I can't do nothing with that I can't pick up because I don't have space <sighs> all right what was it that was going on over here the door is broken I can't go any further there's no choice but to take out the wall what does that mean like can I can I blow up the wall Am I just gonna waste ammo? Yes, I am just gonna waste ammo. I have no idea. I don't know what that's supposed to mean. Okay, so now that we've done some stuff, I feel pretty good about saving it now. Let's drop off a bunch of crap. We don't need you, you for a little while. Oh, we probably should reload that. I used ammo and I really shouldn't have. I didn't know. I didn't know. How would I have known? All right, we are gonna save it though. Get the key card. Crap. the game's just like there's no choice but to take out the wall <laughs> what hey more ribbon thank you I don't need it but I'll take it <clears throat> I just need to make sure there's nothing else hiding in the shadows over here I'm 
sure I'm gonna need to reconnect, recollect the gems. No, that's all right. Anyway. <laughs> There's no choice but to take out the wall. I, I don't understand what that's supposed to mean. Obviously we need to do something. They wouldn't highlight that if I didn't have to do something with it. All right, let's drop off these ink ribbons. Don't really need them. And let's go to the computer. Pretty sure I can get to it from here. Yes. first. Best Resident Evil made. Um, I actually, from what I've played so far, I kind of prefer the first Resident Evil, though this one's definitely more smooth, but I feel like the puzzles are a little more straightforward, which is good if you're aiming for, um, simplicity but I don't know but this this is the first time that I've played through this Resident Evil oh man I don't like that there's so many people in here we not excuse me sir um what was I saying oh so um this is the first time I played through Resident Evil 2 I did just finish Leon's side, so now I'm playing through Claire. Um, and I'm fairly new to the Resident Evil series. I played Resident Evil 1 and 4 last year, and you know now I'm playing through 2. And I'm having a good time. They're both good? Yeah, totally. Oh good, here is what I want. We'll go ahead and take that now, why not? Although, we're hurting, but it's not terrible. Not terrible, maybe we'll just wait. I really enjoy the way I don't know, like, I enjoy the clunkiness of the tank controls, you know? Like, that kind of adds to the... Great. That kind of adds to the fear of it. Just because, like, you're struggling with the zombies, but you're also struggling with the controls. my legs alone no means no sir um I scared the crap out of you when you were a kid yeah for sure it does I fully understand that 
Again, I, I stayed away from these when I was a kid. It just wasn't in my realm of games. I played a lot of Spyro and Final Fantasy, but I never picked up the Resident Evil series. And I'm sad now because I feel like I missed out on a bunch of stuff. So I'm kind of trying to replay it again or, you know, play it authentically where I'm playing the first Resident Evil um, on the original system with the original, you know, the original setup, what it was intended to be. THPS. I, I don't know that acronym. I'm sorry. I think I've already read this one too. Oh, Tony Hawk Pro Skater. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yep. Um, I played the second one on the PlayStation quite a bit. But I was actually more into Cool Borders. <laughs> it's like the snowboarding equivalent. I played that one a lot. Okay, yeah. Uh, I'm pretty sure I've read all of this already. It's nothing new. Just giving you a over an overview of what's going on here. It's really sad that I can't buy a pop. Come on now. She is thirsty. Maybe she wants an orange juice. All right, we can't do this. You had the demo disc for Cool Borders 4? Nice. Um, I played Cool Borders 2, and there, there was like a ton of extra characters. I think you could get like an alien at some point, like as a bonus character. I really just liked it because as soon as you got into the air, you could just button mash and hit like ridiculous scores. <laughs> so I felt like I was a pro. I wasn't, but it was fun. Alright, well, I've made no progress in this room. There's like nothing to do in here. Oh, is that ammo laying on the ground? No, it's not. It's just a soda can. Just empty soda cans. Alright, let's get out of here. Oh, yeah, yeah, yeah. Um, SSX. I've, I've seen a lot of that on the PS2. I thought this was the stars room. It must be up another floor. Or it's on the other side. Uh, uh, uh. We'll try and go south. This way, I believe. It's locked. Oh, hey. Uh, Larry's not standing here. What the heck? Why isn't he here? Does he come later? <laughs> Is that what we were naming him? Larry? I don't remember now. Any ammo here? 
<laughs> Fine. I'll have to remember that for later. You know me from the Amazon Music Podcast. Interesting. I didn't even know that the podcast was on Amazon Music, but thank you. Thanks for stopping in. How's it going? Hope you're having a wonderful day. I mean, it doesn't surprise me, I guess, because everything kind of feeds from um, iTunes. But I do try to get the podcast like literally anywhere. <laughs> We're going to save it. All right. Oh, we should combine these before dropping them off. So, uh, what podcast episodes have you listened to? Um, I guess after having, you know, over, I think 77 was our most recent one. Um, what's cool is I tend to get people from like different, you know, different niches, you know? Did you unlock the costume? No, I don't know what you're talking about, Tony. I'm not sure. Um, but yeah, so like, because we play so many different games, basically we play video games from beginning to end. And at the end, we sit down and we have a podcast where we review it. And um, we've got 70 other games under our belt right now. Um, we've got, I have, I've already kind of talked about Resident Evil 1 and 4, but then we've also done, um, the Final Fantasy series one through um, nine, and um, we've done like the first three Spyro games. We've done um, just a bunch of other random stuff. Uh, so you know, it's fun to to meet up with people who have listened to some of the other podcasts and see what you know what they were interested in, what brought them to the show. <laughs> So, Tony, what other costume is there? And how do I unlock it? I mean, I didn't do very good with Leon, so odds are that's what I was supposed to do, and I just didn't. I was supposed to do better. <laughs> Poor Claire. Maybe I'll give her... Maybe I'll give her one. Oh, I'm trying to combine it with her. No. Just cancel, please. Thank you. Use. There we go. She's doing good now. Claire's special costume. Resident Evil 4 and Final Fantasy 8. Nice. Yeah, great. Yeah, Resident Evil 4 I had a lot of fun with. Um, and then Final Fantasy 8 we just finished not too long ago. Um, obviously, we've done 8 and 9 now. But yeah, great games. Well, I'm glad. I'm glad to hear. Welcome in. Yeah, Tony, how do you get the special costume? And by the way, just so you guys know, I'm streaming on both Facebook and Twitch. So that's why you might not be able to see each other's comments because they're coming through on both channels. We need to do this. Nope. Please no. This is dumb that it's the same puzzle, like switch it up a little bit or something. I already know the trick, man. So Resident Evil 4, I played on the Wii. And I feel like it made that game so much easier. 
I don't think I could play it now on anything else. If I were to try and play it like on the PS2, I think I would just fail. You have to make it to the police station with killing any zombies. And there's a zombie stars guy and kill him with your knife. That sounds terrible. <laughs> I don't think I've done it. It's probably like one pixel off. Yeah, there we go. Special costume you get it from the beginning. You had to do all the running through the station without using bullets. Okay, well I've already I've already lost. <laughs> I've already not done that. <laughs> so, yeah, that's off the table. Next time. Okay, so this is gonna do me no good until I get back to that room. But I need the second one anyway, so there's no point in making it all the way to that room until I have the second one. What's funny is, Claire and Leon are supposed to be doing this at the same time, but like, Claire and Leon both are doing the same puzzles, so it's like, I don't know, paradoxical. <laughs> It's it's creating a paradox that does not work. Leon. Leon. It's good to see you're still among the living. It looks like we're not gonna find your brother here after all. All right, Chris's diary, we've already looked through. <clears throat> Not too worried about that. There's no reason for us to stay any longer than necessary. Let's split up, look for any survivors. Splitting up is a terrible idea. Right. One last. Thing. Just so you know, in Here's case a of a zombie apocalypse, if any of your friends say, let's split that up, the answer is always going to be no. Leon! <laughs> Are you going to just stay here, or... Okay, you can just stay here, that's fine. I got stuff to do. Alright, we got a key. Okay, thank you. I like Jill's desk. It's fun. It's a picture of a young man. Can I not? I swear I collected something from this box when I was here before. Aha! What is this? I didn't find this last time. She's getting all kinds of interesting ammo. Like literally, Leon had the pistol, the shotgun, and the flamethrower that I never actually used. Maybe I just didn't open the right stuff. Done everything. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Thank you, Leon. 
Now we know. Um, check that. Green launcher. Yeah, I don't. I think I'm good. This is different. What's going on? What is this contraption? <laughs> As per your request. Oh, jeez. Dude, okay, if you're involved in a big cover-up, maybe don't be out raping people. Like, just saying. I mean, in general, you probably shouldn't anyway, but especially so. <laughs> Terrible. No, definitely don't. I guess if he's going to go to jail for something, at least they got him on that. <laughs> Terrible people. All right. Anyway, what are we doing? We were going to leave. And then we got the facts. Car facts. <clears throat> oh, hey. Help me! <clears throat> help me, help! <sighs> the only Resident Evil where that word is written. Interesting. It's funny that, it's funny that, I don't know, out of everything, I guess they're just trying to frame this guy as just a terrible person. Okay, yeah, I don't like these guys. I'm pretty sure there's a ton of them. I'm not gonna waste ammo, I would rather just like blow them away. Okay. Alright, yeah. That's doing nothing. Can we just like walk on by? You guys just enjoy your meal. Oh my gosh. 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 No, 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 no. Excuse me, sirs. Oh, this is a dead end, isn't it? My leg alone. <sighs> now Claire's got a stomach ache and everything. Will you use the lockpick? Why, yes, I will. I sure will use the lockpick. <clears throat> Need a lot more than that. Poor Claire and her stomach ache. Alright, we're 
we're back here again. What's going on? Oh, right. in here I wonder if the puzzles changed wouldn't that be nice ah! all right let's look at you <clears throat> nope it's like the exact same puzzle Actually, it might already be in the spots. Um, okay. Blue in between, nothing, and then yellow in between. Should be that easy. We'll see. Nope. Oh yeah, it's already active. Oh no, here we go. So those two are already good. This one has to go to the right. I know, Minecraft zombie sounds. Oops, that's the wrong way. That was wrong. It totally is too, like, I wonder if it is like officially the same sound bites. That one, and this one just needs to go over a couple times, or once. Oops. I don't remember the serpent stone. remember that from Leon's playthrough all right where are we going we can go up the stairs we can go out this door let's look at our map yeah we'll go ahead and go up the stairs why not why not check it out it's not like Claire has to use the bathroom or anything <laughs> sorry I make that joke far too often just because it's so silly that she's constantly holding her stomach <clears throat> I mean granted she probably has like severe wounds but <clears throat> Crank. Oh, and this is where we get the other gem, too. Yeah, you like that? Thank you. Um, if you want to see, let's see if this works. I don't even remember now. I think it's game room. Let's see if that works. No. Um. Apparently none of them are working. Never mind. Oh, there it goes. Okay. <clears throat> so if you want to check out the game room setup, 
Um, that that's a little walkthrough of the game room as a whole. Um, but yeah, uh, we've got quite the extensive game room going on here. My my bot was a little laggy, I guess. I don't know. <clears throat> but uh. Yeah, that, that video will walk you through everything I've got going on here, and you'll be able to see the the game, the box wall a little closer. We've been collecting for quite a while. Um, it's not like my original stuff from growing up uh, some of it is like original to me but a lot of it's not like some of the older stuff i found at garage sales but it's fun i enjoy collecting it's not as easy as it used to be five years ago it was super easy like people were just selling this stuff at garage sales left and right and now it's like you don't see much anymore people are buying it up like crazy all right what do i want <clears throat> I need to get a box. That's what I need. Let's go to a box. Maybe save it too. Sounds like fun. room has got zombies in it now that I think about it. Yep. I don't want to waste ammo on them. Not worth my time. Um, let's see. There's another one. Pass your collection down to the youngins. Yeah, that's good. That's definitely a good way to go about it. Uh, I decided not to have kids quite a while ago. And, um, I don't know. This is just my life now. <laughs> playing playing, and collecting video games is just, just what I do. I wish I could make a living off of it. I don't want to go this way. Can I open this box without... Yeah, they just pause. Good. I like that. No, we, we need to keep that, actually. Drop this off. Drop this off. Keep the key. We'll... I, I think we'll keep... Maybe we'll keep the bow gun instead of the grenade launcher since we don't have any ammo for that. Yeah, everything is expensive now, especially the classic stuff on the internet. Exactly. Well, and see, now my collection is... The majority of it is from garage sales. Garage sales and thrift shops and stuff like that. Um, but yeah, like right now, the retro stuff is super expensive. And so I'm glad I collected when I did, but part of me is like, should I sell it? <laughs> you know, like, why not? Why not make a bunch of money? Because I have everything saved in um, price charting, and my collection is worth like $60,000 right now. No way I paid that much for it, but like, just because the retro stuff is skyrocketing, it's crazy. <clears throat> Yeah, exactly. Some people do get really lucky right now, but it's it's all about getting out there and looking for it. If you're not, you know, if you're if you only stop at one or two garage sales, you may get lucky once in a while, but you know. Yeah, I I have a pretty good time. <laughs> <laughs> I appreciate it. I'm glad. I'm glad that you like it. Again, I 
I have put a lot of money into it, but it's like maybe a quarter of what it's worth. Your sneaker collection keeps growing. <laughs> I mean, yeah, for sure. <clears throat> that stuff holds value. I don't know why. Just some people. I guess, okay, I take that back. I have a feeling I know why. For me, anyway, when I have a pair of shoes that I love, they wear out, right? So, like, for me to want to buy them again, you can't because, oh my gosh, no. No, 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 no. Oh, no. Oh my gosh. I'm dead. I'm dead. I'm, I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. I'm gonna die. And I didn't save it for, like, a long time, so I don't know how much more I'm gonna have to do. Gosh dang it. And I knew this room was trouble, too. The whole time. Poop. Oh well. We'll just have to do it all over again. Resident I can't, I honestly have no idea when the last time was I saved it. I'm pretty sure I'm gonna have to do a lot of stuff over again. I thought, I guess I thought because I put a bunch of stuff in the boxes that I was good, but no. <laughs> Ah, don't worry about it. I'm all right. All right, what do we got? We're gonna drop off some stuff. Yeah, I'm way back here. It's my own fault for sitting in chit-chatting instead of playing the game though to be honest I would rather chit-chat and just you know I'm, I'm still having a good time it doesn't matter if I die or not I'll make it eventually but yeah so when you're buying shoes to buy I, I would like to buy the same pair that I have but like they don't make them anymore right so i would have to go on ebay to buy them and if there's only one guy on ebay selling them for like 200 bucks then you pay what you you know what's out there or collectibles too i used to have a huge collection of puma uh do i have to do this puzzle again i do poop Can we please? Thank you. The sneaker game is ruined right now. Is it because of all the fakes? I bought a pair of Adidas and I swear that they were fake. They didn't seem fake, but man, they felt terrible. Can we please? Thank you. Oh, I... Oh, it's like one pixel off again. There we go. Hey, thanks for the sub. On YouTube. Dude, all right, come on. Come on, get up here. Let's go. There you go. <laughs> Are you offended that I picked you up? Chill. There we go. No? What is it like? One pixel off on both sides? Come on. There we go. Finally. People flood the sites with bots. Yeah, that sucks. I mean, honestly, that's a similar problem I have with video games. I mean, people people are out there buying to scalp them, you know, turn around and sell them on eBay for a profit. And then there's people like me who just want to buy them to enjoy the games. And you can't because of all the scalpers that are out there, you know, doing this as a full-time job. Where me, I'm holding down a full-time job and just want to enjoy the games. 
I mean, I get I get that a lot at like garage sales. But also like Pokemon cards right now is a big deal. I know I love you too, but I'm playing a video game. This is the stars room. Yeah, okay, let's open the door, please. Man, we're way back here. Luckily, we can just kind of fly through all this crap. Leon! <clears throat> Leon! It's good to see you're still among the living. Yeah, yeah, so. It looks like. I turned on the audio a little bit. Um. So, I have. A tree tattoo. This was my first one. Oh no, I lie. This was my second one. My first ones were the um, so hard to tell. These on my on my arms. I have this one is Aishima and this one is Vivizert, and they're uh, they're like Nordic runes. And then I have the whole like rune set along my my arm. Let's see if you uh, let's see if you can see them. There you go. They go all the way up to my shoulder. And then I have two on my forearms. I have catnip on my on my shoulder, a uh, catnip plant. And then I have two of um, two ravens on my calves, all like kind of Nordic themed, but also like me. <laughs> all right, we've read this already. There's no reason for us to stay any longer. <clears throat> All right, I'll turn this back up. Look for any survivors and get out of here. Right. One last thing. Here's a radio. Take it. That way we can keep in touch if anything happens. Yeah. I, uh... I started following, you know, seeing when people have their own style. Yeah, yeah, that's exactly it. Like for me, I wanted to have tattoos that um, I really enjoyed, but like also was a prompt to start a discussion with other people. And I, you know, it's just cool. It's fun. Some people think that like, my tattoos are snowflakes. <laughs> I've gotten that a couple times. Um, but some people, you know, know what they are and they're like, oh, that's really cool. And that's, you know, that's fun. Many people have Roman numerals, rose, dove. Yeah, yeah, yeah. Yeah, some people just do like flash, which is fine. I mean, if that's your thing. If you just enjoy getting tattooed, I completely understand that concept. But again, you know, for the people who don't know, it's a good way, it's a good conversation starter. Alright, I think we're good. <clears throat> Oh, maybe I should at least pick it up. <laughs> help me! Help me, help! I mean, I don't really need to. <laughs> I don't really need to kill that guy. Oh hey, he's that still in here. Can keep in touch if anything happens. Okay. Oh yeah, we've already read all this.
You have yours covered up only on your thighs. Nope, 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 nope. Well, he has nothing to do with the one in Resident Evil 4. Alright, I like got screwed in here. I forgot. Avatar Last Airbender, yeah, for sure. You're a huge op. Oh, okay, you have a huge oppa with tons of color. Nice. That's awesome. You always get made fun of. Ah, uh, no, the show's amazing. I I haven't finished it, but I've wa I've watched a lot of it. Can I just? Can we just? No, 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 no. Okay, yes, that's fine. Don't get risky. I know, right? I don't want to have to do all this over yet again. <laughs> That's the last thing I want. Alright. Okay, we just need to do the puzzle. Get that out of the way. If I can get through this faster and with less ammo, then I'm doing good. <laughs> then there will have been some point to uh, replaying all of this over again. You never come on Twitch, decided to hop on. Nice. Well, yeah, I appreciate you jumping on and hanging out. Yeah, no, I, I totally get it. I got to get up and go to work too tomorrow. But yeah, thanks for stopping in, and I hope to see you again. Enjoy the rest of your week as well. I hope it's a wonderful one. I know that it's only Monday. I will be playing again tomorrow night, if that sounds interesting at all. Feel free to stop in anytime, though. I appreciate someone to chat with. Uh, this one doesn't need to move. It's this one. It's really stressful, but even so, you beat this game like six times. Nice. That's intense. But I mean, I get it. When you are in love with the game, you just play it, you know? I'm like that with Final Fantasy VII, except I don't play it all the way through every time. Simply because it's an RPG that's like 40 hours long and I just don't have time for that. But I do tend to play like the first disc over again <laughs> from time to time. Though I can definitely see playing Resident Evil, you know, one and two now. I just, I love the tank controls. I love the like, the PS1 era of art is just so unique. All right, we need to use this. We'll do that. Yep, that's better. Ish. Uh, let's look at our map. Um. A couple doors that I'd like to go through. Nothing that's super important, though. Ah, Lori, with some blue. I actually can't see those on the multi-chat, so you'll have to let me know if you see any more come through, Lori. Um, hey Google, set Twitch to blue. Okay, changing four lights to blue. Uh, hey Google, 
set brightness. Oh, hang on. Stop. Okay, yeah, no, that's fine. Hey, Google. Set Twitch brightness to 50%. Got it. Setting four lights brightness to 50%. There we go. Hey, Google. Set game room lights to blue. <laughs> no, it's fine. It's just my brightness now is like super high. There we go. Ooh, mood lighting. Final Fantasy VII, favorite game, but it takes a long time to play. Yeah, for sure. And Final Fantasy IX, yeah, absolutely. Um. When we played through Final Fantasy IX, I actually got through it a lot faster than I was expecting to get through it. <laughs> Typically, when we play RPGs, we give ourselves two months to do, and we managed to get through it in just a month, which is very surprising. Though I did, like, really try hard to get it out <laughs> within a month to get it beat. But, I mean, I, I stick to the, ska the same schedule, which is basically, like three days a week, three hours a day. I think I was bumping it up to like four hours a day just to push out Final Fantasy IX. But man, I love Final Fantasy IX. I really enjoyed Final Fantasy VIII also. Um, I, you know, I don't play those games as much because I love Final Fantasy VII so much. So I play those, I play seven all the time. But then like to replay eight and nine, was really nice and you know fully experiencing the game instead of like half-assing it like I used to do when I was little we're gonna be starting Final Fantasy 10 eventually um, I don't know if it's gonna be next next month but very soon. Hey, Resident Evil Jesse, how's it going? Hope you're having a wonderful day today. I don't know where I'm going. I really should save it, so maybe we'll go down and we'll we'll save it. Before I do anything stupid again. I didn't even know this was here. That was random. Thank you, me. <laughs> so we're playing Resident Evil 2. I have not played Resident Evil 2 before. Well, I mean, before this playthrough. I have finished Leon's part. Um, so now we're playing through Claire. Um, and I'm fairly new to the Resident Evil series as a whole, like, I only played Resident Evil 1 and 4 just last year, and that was the first time I've ever played any Resident Evil game. And I'm loving it, like, it's so much fun. I haven't played any of the new ones, I did play, um, oh, let's save it before I get too sidetracked here. Um, I did play Resident Evil 1, the remake on the GameCube like right after beating Resident Evil 1 for the PS1. And it was cool. I really liked the way that they manipulated some of the puzzles to be different enough. Oh crap, I don't have any ink ribbon. Um, all right, we're gonna have to squeeze in this room and not die. All right, we have one job. Get ink ribbon and don't die. That's two jobs, but it's kind of mixed into one, one job. Get ink ribbon while not dying. Nope, 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 nope. <sighs> I'm gonna die. <laughs> Alright, please don't die. We don't need that. We're probably gonna need this now. And this. Nope, 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 no! 
No means no, sir. Lay off the lady bits, please. You know, Jill had the same problem. They just, they're so handsy. Yeah, I, I know. And I knew that that room was like that too, because when I played with Leon, I had the same problem. I think when I played as Leon, I just went in there with a the shotgun and just blew him all away. Alright, how's my health looking? Uh, it's still yellow. Um, map. I really don't want to go back in that room. I could go up above. <laughs> I'd have to kill those guys though. Sorry, I'm thinking out loud. Um, yeah, I think I'm gonna go up above and then go to the right. Then I'm gonna go down those stairs and check out some of the rooms on the right hand side on the lower level. So let's, let's head that way. Can we please? I think I'm gonna wait as long as I possibly can to go into that terrible, terrible room. I'm pretty sure I could go in there and just kind of pick off a few of them and then leave and then come back and pick off a few more because they respawn or they like reset after each, you know, thing. After each like door whatever leave come back they reset that's what I'm trying to say in terrible words um all right we want to go to the south which is right for Claire uh, this way maybe this is the bird room Oh crap. Oh yeah, I just want to go to the end of this hallway. Is this guy still here? Not gonna risk finding out. Like Mr. Concrete Man. You know what? Now that I'm thinking about it, playing through as Leon, we only saw like maybe five dogs total. I hated the dogs in the first one. They were the worst. Okay, no. Maybe I can get by him because that's all I want. Yeah, 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 yeah. It's locked. Oh, poo. No, 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 sir. No, no, no. Okay. I think this is the bad room. Yes, it is. We might be able to get up to the north side of this room, but I'm really worried of what's on the other side of that door. I can't remember. I can't remember what's up there, but if I, if it's locked and I have to backtrack, then I'm screwed because those zombies are not fun. Yeah, maybe, uh, maybe we'll just do something else. <laughs> We'll just go somewhere else for now. It's fine. It's probably fine. Are you playing the whole numbered series right now? Um, not necessarily. I'm playing just... Like, I wanted to play one first, so I did that. And then I played number four 
because uh, a friend of mine really wanted me to play for her. So we did that for the podcast, and that turned out to be a wonderful game. I'm glad that I did that. Um, and then I wanted to play... I, I really liked Resident Evil 1, so I wanted to play something similar. So Resident Evil 2 seemed like the natural progression. Um, so I could see myself playing Resident Evil 3 again, or, you know, playing Resident Evil 3 next um, in the Resident Evil series, and then kind of moving forward from there, maybe playing, maybe playing five, maybe just going with the remakes. I don't know. We'll see. Everyone says that it's terrible after four, so <laughs> I don't know what I'm going to end up doing, but we'll play it by ear. I mean... I'll at least, I'll definitely play Resident Evil 3 as probably my next Resident Evil game. I've heard a lot of people really like 8 though, um, but I think it's hit or miss for the Resident Evil fans. And I kind of understand that because Final Fantasy is going through a very similar thing where the new Final Fantasy games, the fans of the series aren't really digging it. Um, but... I don't know. Three is great. Five and six are... Five and six are just other kind of games, yeah. I, that's really... I think that it's the same thing Final Fantasy is going through. And it's like... They, they want to play with the formula of the basic game because they know that they've already got the audience for it. So it's like, why not change it up? But they have to also modernize it so it has to fit more of a modern audience. But doing that ticks off a lot of classic, you know, players as well. So it's a fine balancing line that people have to do. Developers nowadays have to worry about. All right, what do I want to do? Um, I can go down there. Yeah, we're going to go and check. So we're going to go back into the library. We're going to go out that door and all the way around to the staircase. Then we're going to go down or up the staircase. No, down the staircase, right? Yeah. Anyway, staircase, and then there's a door, like, within that same staircase hallway there. There's a door. So let me... I'm going to go check that door. We'll see if we can get that open. I'm pretty sure the hallway along the back wall, though, that's the second floor, so it might be okay. It might be okay. We'll see. Let's, let's get into the library first. So this is essentially the shotgun. Uh oh. Ah, oh, poop. I can't see nothing. too many shots I wish I could just pull the arrows back out right I mean that would make more sense wouldn't it all 
All right, anyway, those guys are dead. All right, we left this guy in here. Oh, come on. Is he dead this time? Yeah, yeah he dead. He's dead. Okay, yeah, no, I, all right. I understand where you're coming from. Like they're trying to make it relevant, but like they still have to keep it to their genre. So like their genre is to some degree shooter, it's to some degree horror, it's to some degree puzzle. So like they have to keep it within some sort of genre that makes sense to them. Um, where RPG, Final Fantasy, was always like this turn-based RPG until it got to like Final Fantasy 12 and then they started experimenting with it and you know it it's not always the best <laughs> the experiment don't doesn't always turn out very good yay we got through this time um like the battle system changes a little bit like they try to keep it true to its roots but it doesn't always work out that way is this a lighter no plastic bomb okay that's interesting the helicopter is a detonator Oh, I see. So they want me to blow up that wall using the bomb. I understand. Yes, yes, I will be taking those. Thank you. What are you? film I got film in the last playthrough too and I didn't know what to do with it throw it in the garbage I get more ammo I mean I guess I got some bow ammo which is essentially Jill's shotgun and that's fine with me I'm alright with that is this another door I don't remember this being here before we got spooky music now. Oh. <laughs> uh, also, I have a strong feeling that video game developers now have no idea what they're doing. <laughs> they just, they make terrible decisions and they just don't think about it. And I understand they're under a lot of stress because the video games look really good right now. And it takes a lot of effort and development time to make those games look good. So like, you know, the the production teams want them to hurry up and get games out. And then like the developers are like, no, nah, I can't because it takes so much time to make good games. And then they just end up making like half ass games because they're pushed. And I don't know, I think that that's the problem with like Pokemon games right now. Sir, sir, stop, please, no, no. How many bullets do you need? 
At least one more. Oh my gosh, man. Oh no. I'm gonna keep going. Okay, now we're backed up in a corner. Great. Is this just a dead end room? Mm, no, it goes out. Uh, it's just a shame that Final Fantasy is not turn-based, I agree. Um, Persona and Dragon Quest combat system. I, I honestly haven't played any Persona games. I need to change that really bad. Really bad. Um, it would be awesome to have Final Fantasy games like that. Uh, I Probably. <laughs> I Again, I haven't played any of the Persona games. I have played Dragon Quest games. And I've played um, Bravely Default is pretty good. I played the first one. I have the second one, but I haven't played it. I know, right? I know, I need I need to get on it, Persona. I've had a few people tell me that. Okay, you know what? We're gonna equip this bad boy. I think we're gonna need it. Oh, maybe not. Maybe we may be able to squeeze by here. I have to play five at least. I think I have, I can't remember off the top of my head which one I have. I, I have one of them. Um, it, oh, you gotta be kidding me right now. Um, I have, I think Persona 5, Persona 5 or Persona 4? Hang on, I'm gonna check now. I need to know. Um, where are my games? Persona. I have Persona 4 Golden Edition. I don't know if that means much. On the Vita. Oh, I have. Oh, no, that's not Persona. That's Personal Trainer. <laughs> Personal Trainer Cooking on. The Nintendo DS. That's the other <laughs> Persona game that I have. So as you know. Uh, but yeah, Persona 4. That's the one that I have. Um... Well, we're going to have to come back in here eventually. Is that a... Uh... No, that safe isn't in here anymore. No, 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 no. Oh, I got lucky there. Did you guys see that? Holy crap. Oh, all right. Oh, I can't collect this. Oh, that's fine. I think I'll leave and come back later. Um, but yes, Persona, I'll probably, I'll probably play it eventually. The thing is, um, when I only really have time to play games for the podcast, so, um, when I play games, I always try and keep that in mind that I'm playing them for a podcast and the podcast, I really need someone to play with, uh, to review it with. And it just depends on if my sister is interested in playing or if I find one of my friends that want to play with me. So it'll come down the pipe eventually when I have someone to sit down and review it with me. I also have to worry about people having the game, which isn't always the hardest thing. Um, but, you know... It can be depending on the game like if I ever get rule of rose That's like a $500 video game To find someone to play that with me would be very difficult 
Though I have friends that do have that game. Alright, um, no, I'm... Um, you know what? No, I, I think I'm just gonna keep those in there. I think that's okay. Um, Jill. Jill, Jill, Jill is not who I'm playing as. It's Claire. It's really difficult to change my brain. I don't know why. I didn't have this problem with Leon. Alright, um... Maybe we'll eat one. Though she's not doing terrible. Oh, yeah, I guess she is. Alright, we need the lighter. The lighter will get us into that painting, wherever that was. Down this hallway. I remember, I remember it being tucked in a little room. I'll find it. Hey, oh yeah, and it's an 85 hour game. Yeah, there is that as well that I have to compete with. down no leave the legs alone goodness sir um but yeah I mean there there's so many games that I want to play that it's ridiculous I mean pff, hollow knight um uh what's that other rpg on the switch um octopath octopath traveler i want to play that game really bad all right i think i have everything in that room i don't really need to do anything else although i could have probably unlocked it from the other side It's tough when we only really play 12 games a year. Oh, whoa, 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 whoa. Um, we play one game a month for the podcast. And um, like this month, I'm playing through Resident Evil 2. So we'll, at the end of this month, we'll review it. And that'll be July 1st podcast. And then... Um, you know, then we'll start up another game after that. I think we're going to start playing. F I don't know for sure. I have to talk to my sister, but we'll probably start playing Final Fantasy 10. Maybe it's it's definitely going to be either 10 or Final Fantasy Type 0 or Chrono Trigger. Not sure which of those, but it'll be one of those. And then um, while we're playing that, we'll play Elibits to fill the time slot for August 1st, because we'll probably take two months to play Final Fantasy X. It's usually how we do it. We also really want to try and get in Valkyrie Profile. Pfft, I have no idea. I know that that's a long game, and every time I bring it up, it's like anxiety inducing. <laughs> so, I don't know how soon we'll get to that, but I really would like to play it. Alright, let's see if we can figure out where that room was with the, uh. with the, um. fireplace. Mm. 
Is that the stars room? No, that's the stars room. What's that room then? That must be the room that we need. Okay, let's... We'll try. We'll, we'll check that out. Alright, so I'm gonna go... Floor one on the left-hand side, top right room. It's like within that hallway there. We'll see what's going on in that room. I don't know if that's where I want to go or not. Um, which means we want to go back in this room. I think... Are all the zombies dead or do we got that one? We might just have that one. I don't know where he's at. Okay, he's on that side. Alright, we're gonna go in here. We did play Assassin's Creed Valhalla not too long ago, and that was a long game. We ended up needing three months to beat that game, which is a record for the podcast. Um, sorry, I need to look at the map again. I want to go in that room. This one. I think I had like 80 some hours in that game too. Yeah, I think this might be the room. Yes, yes, yes. <laughs> you suck. Oh, it's a detonator, that's why. That's why. Alright, well... Guess we need to go get our explosive again and blow up that wall. Pretty sure that's all we really need to do. Blow up that wall. Let's go back the way we came, I guess. I think this is the right way. Nope. Mm. Nope, 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 nope. Oh, did you see how close that was? Like millimeters. <laughs> Took a wrong turn somewhere. Oh, well, let's see if we can get in that room now. It's locked. Access denied. Oh yeah, I think I went the complete wrong way. Get our explosives. Can I like combine the two? Is that what it wants me to do? Yeah, there we go. Okay. Don't worry about me, I'm just walking around with an active bomb in my pocket. Um, I'm just gonna do it. I'm just gonna do it. 
poor Claire has been walking around with a stomach ache for far too long. All right, I want to go in. Wait. Pretty sure we want. Um. I'm gonna go back out to the hallway. We really either floor, first floor, or second floor. No, second floor. Which means we want to go upstairs now. like itching I don't know what the deal is all right stars room is this guy still here I was gonna say he shouldn't be is this wrong Pretty sure I've gone the wrong way. Ah, no, this is fine. side of the balcony Whoa. You know what, I'm gonna go ahead and save it. It's been a while. I have lots of ribbon. Let's just do it before I make a stupid mistake. save it now <laughs> nah it's fine I'll be all right all right we need to blow up this wall oh can we do it from here I 
Apparently we need to do it on the door. Nice. I don't know if we've been in here. Ooh, very fancy. Oh, she did. Oh, I'm terribly sorry. I thought you were another one of those zombies. Zombies. Are you Chief Irons? Yes, that's me. And just who are you? No, don't bother telling me. It makes no difference. You'll end up just like all the others. That's the mayor's daughter. I was told to look after her. But I failed miserably. Just look at her. Look at she her. was a true beauty. Her skin nothing short of perfection. But it will soon putrefy and she will turn into a zombie within the hour like all the others. There must be some way to stop it. In a manner of speaking. Yeah, is, I mean, you just kill him. Either by putting a bullet through her brain or by decapitating her completely. <laughs> He's like, it's what I do. I to think that taxidermy used to be my hobby. But no longer. Please. I'd really like to be alone now. Can I kill him? Oh, that's lame. All right, so he's got a couple more doors. Yeah, we've got a whole other door that we can go in. Let's check that out. Ooh, fancy. Secrets or secretary's diary, the secret diary. So it's the empty page. Wait, let me go. Easy, easy there. I'm not a zombie. You're safe now. <laughs> You're safe now, child. I'm your mother. <laughs> <laughs> this is fine. It's probably fine. My name's Claire. What's yours? Sherry, do you know where your parents are? They both work at the Umbrella Chemical Plant near the city limits. 
the chemical plant, then what are you doing here? My mom called and told me to go to the police station because it was too dangerous to stay at home. From the look of things, I'd say she was probably right, but it's dangerous here as well. You'd better come with me. But there's something out there. I don't know what it is, but I saw it. Much larger than any of those zombies. And it's coming after me. What was that? That's what I was telling you about. It's here. Sherry, wait. Nah, that's fine. Ah, yes, thank you. Anything else helpful you can give me? No? There's a lot of scenes in this room. Tiger comes to life. It's a stuffed animal. It's just a fluffy. It's a heart key. Sure, I'll push the button. Ah, we got tiles. Yes, of course. So tile sitting here. Or it's a diary. And that chief is Jill's boss and father. No, I don't know. <laughs> I mean, technically he's uh, Leon's boss too, right? Just for the, just for a night. It was beautiful.
Well, that's not crazy. Oh, I don't have... I don't have the tiles that I need. I want to read the raccoon. Fine. All right. What else do we have? Now that we have the the heart key. did that I there's probably doors that I could have unlocked if I had just looked at them first um but yeah so there's a couple rooms that I still need to open specifically on this floor Um, yeah. Which way do I want to go? I think... I think I'm going to go try and open that door in the hallway on the left bottom corner that like empty door there I could go to the right top but I know there's a bunch of zombies in that hallway so I think I'm gonna save that for later <clears throat> but now that I have the arrow the crossbow sorry uh, it should be a little bit easier um, that said I still need to figure out how to get there okay through the store that's right next to me through that door and then down the stairs down the ladder so the store the store kill everything in here I don't think I did I kill the important one no not no means no sir I'm not fooled get back up come on oh I can just like kind of no wait Hey, thank you. This is the first one I've seen. 
I think I ended the game with Leon. He had like six of them. I didn't even need them. Kidding me? All right. Well, that one's out of the question. Um, where else can we go? I guess the only other room really is the bottom right. Oh, there are two rooms over there, but we still—I mean, we may as well just kill the zombies. We're gonna have to do it eventually. We'll just save it first. That's where we'll go, because that's the only thing we got left. already 2236 just in case I need it again something about the statue Save it. Uh, isn't there a save thing in here? No? Hmm, huh, guess not. I mean, it's fine because there is one out here, but it's just weird. save my progress I'm gonna drop off my ink ribbon in case I need the storage space Should be enough. Should be enough. Oh, I got nine anyway. Nine should be more than enough. I want to go this way. saved it ah! um, nom, 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 nom. not bad I think I've only died what twice now and this time I fully expected to die so there's that Resident it's fine <laughs> it's probably fine 
It's most likely fine. <laughs> We're all tired here. <laughs> Yes, it has been a long day. So I work at a IT. I I'm an IT at my job, and uh, we have a whole bunch of new people starting on Monday. So I have to uh, build all of their computers and all of their accounts and everything, um, which is fine. It just takes so much of my time and energy. Oh my gosh, how did he survive that to the throat? I'm gonna die. Oh my gosh. <laughs> om nom nom. Oh, she's delicious. Tastes like ham. All right, um, <laughs> should I just start a new game at this point or? <laughs> it wouldn't be so bad, except it's terrible. Um, maybe I'll just try and go a different route and we'll not kill those guys right now. Um, Gosh, just the other route is, no, I guess it's not terrible. Just need to go up this, the ladder and to the right and through all those doors and then go back down the stairs. All right, let's do it. Freaking do it. I might be able to get through that if I healed halfway through, but I don't know. Be great if I had a shotgun, Leon. Every day working with computers, watching screens daily. Why am I not wearing glasses? Um, I don't know. I mean, it just doesn't bother me. There are days, especially once I start getting tired, that it's really hard to read, but it's usually just while I'm tired. Um, I mean, for the most part, I don't have many problems with my eyes. I'm sure that I'll change as I start getting older, but as I start as, as I start getting older, as if I'm not older now, but yeah. As I get older, I'm sure I'll have to start wearing glasses eventually. I don't look forward to it, but nice jeans, <laughs> I suppose. It's funny because my my mom's side of the family has terrible eyesight, so I guess my dad's side of the family must be pretty good. I mean, it's not terrible. It's just a lot of them wear glasses pretty early. I'm just going to sneak on by. Leave me alone. No, no, sir, sir, no. Can we not? He's just determined. Determination. Really? We'll just walk on by. Life is hard when you need to see through a crystal. <laughs> Oh, okay. 
Where are we? Oh, we're downstairs now. Right. Right. Um. I know there's a save point up here at the top of the stairs, but I don't want to kill all the zombies to be able to get in there. I can't see nothing oh my gosh I can't see I just I can't what am I supposed to do oh my gosh please no can we not oh my goodness I can't see a thing it's probably a bad choice of directions. And I have no ammo. <laughs> oh no. This is fine. All oh, right, dogs. Do I even want to be in here? Is there anything over here? I'm sure, yeah, we'll go down. <laughs> Just keep going down, it's fine. Figure it out. I think there's a save point here. I don't know if I want the save point. I don't have much for ammo. Like, literally not much. I do have some healing items. Still not much. Um... I don't know, man. Not liking my odds. I think this goes nowhere. Oh. Sherry, I've been looking everywhere for you. I was so worried. We've got to go now, honey, okay? If we stay here, that monster will find us. Let's go. No, I won't. What's the matter? <laughs> Don't you trust me? Don't you Not trust me as a stranger? Here. It's because of my daddy. He's over there. I heard him call my name. Daddy must have been attacked by the monsters. I have to help him. Yeah, let's not do that. No, that's under construction. Wait, Sherry, don't go alone. Sherry, Sherry. All right, now we're playing as Sherry. Do we have anything? We have one healing item. This kind of reminds me of the Ashley sequences. This is probably fine. Oh my gosh! Nope. <laughs> Her necklace is like going crazy. Alright, we'll try that again.
I really don't know where I'm supposed to go. How am I supposed to get through here? Oh, all right. We just walk, that's how. Obviously. Okay, so I can't do this. I don't think this really helps me any. I think she's too small to climb down. So maybe we're supposed to go to the other side. No, apparently not. I really thought she was going to be too small to climb down here. All right, first off, we'll push this one. Up we go. Come on. She like slipped. Come on. Hey, we got the key. We got a key. check over here if there's anything special to collect aha like this Just have to make a bag. Don't get puked on. <laughs> Hi, bud. Are you gonna come up here? Sherry, are you okay? Did you find your dad? Yes, I'm okay. But I couldn't find him. But I did find something else for you. Here. Here's another. Are you coming? Come on. Thanks, sweetie. Now, why come don't on. you come over here? Come here. I want you to stay with me. Come on. Claire, I can't. 
can't reach the ventilation hole anymore. But don't worry, Come on. I'll find another way. I can take care of myself. Wait, Sherry, come back. Sherry! You're Sherry! Good boy. You're a good boy. Do you read me, Claire? We now have access to the back of the parking lot. Got it. I'm getting out of here and heading to the sewer. Can you meet me there? I'm on my way. Can't see. Get your stick tail out of my face. fine and great except we still have no ammo um i'm gonna just save it i'm just gonna save it and hope that we can dodge everything coming up so this is gonna be real bad if we can I don't need to use two. Alright, let's drop this off. Though, probably just gonna stop for tonight. Alright, let's see how hard it is to get back up. Dogs. Gotta get past the dogs. Though the reality is I shouldn't have any need to come back down here again. No, no, no. No, 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 no. No, 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 no. <laughs> I might use another save ribbon. Oh my gosh. <sighs> Alright. I don't know if we're gonna make it down this hallway though. No, 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 no! Oh my gosh, oh my gosh, no. There's another zombie around this corner. There's not. I'm going to pick these up. Is this a thing? No. Zombies are so handsy.
Okay, I really want to know what's in this room over here. It's probably not worth my time going over there to figure it out, but here we are. This isn't. Freaking garbage. <sighs> what a waste. I'm an idiot. I'm not gonna save it. I think I'm just gonna end it here. I don't know, do I? It's so tempting. I just, I know I'm gonna have to come through here again. Or maybe not. The biggest question mark is... The room at the top right. There's a couple rooms over there. And the room on the bottom left. I think those are the only rooms that I haven't unlocked. Besides being down down here. I know that the room on the bottom right going from from the room that I'm in going through the room on the bottom right that hallway is just a mess like getting through that is going to be a nightmare um oh yeah no problem thank you so much for stopping by and hanging out um, I'll be playing again tomorrow if that sounds interesting at all you want to swing back by that would be awesome if not I completely understand um, but yeah I'm gonna be stopping soon anyway so um, yeah thanks again for hanging out and watching and you know stop by again and we'll see you next time in the meantime I'm gonna figure out what I want to do if I want to save it or not I might not I might just go in guns a blazing to this next room I don't know what I want. Um, yeah. 
think we are just gonna go in guns a blazing. We'll see. Freaking do it. exactly how I planned it not to go <laughs> all right guys I am gonna end it here for tonight thank you all so much for hanging out and watching this part for Resident Evil 2 I hope you had a good time um yeah I, I am gonna be playing tomorrow hopefully I plan on playing tomorrow um we'll probably make it a little further in the game hopefully uh, if you want to see more of the Resident Evil 2 playthrough, I have all of Leon's storyline. You can watch that at our uh, secondary YouTube channel, which is Zap Night Plays. Uh, that's where we archive all of the gameplay from previous games. Um, otherwise, you can check us out at zapnight.com, where you can see all of our, all of our previous podcast episodes. Um, you can watch a uh, walkthrough of our game room if you're interested in something like that. There's a uh, Resident Evil 1 where I've clipped all, all of the good parts of the gameplay into like a, a little series. If that sounds interesting, you can check that out too. Uh, but yeah, guys, thank you all so much for hanging out and watching, and we'll see you guys next time.